Um, excuse me. Yeah. Um, I saw you over there and you had like a cool look to you. Right. <laughs> I don't know. So I just want to come and say hi. Hello. Hi, I'm nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> um, Somebody. I, I, I thought you were originally Swedish or something, no, but English, English yeah. I can tell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very interesting. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I feel like we're similar ages. Uh, I don't know. How old are you? Guess. No, I'm not good at guessing ages. You're not good at guessing ages? No. I am almost. Ah, Does it look? Similar. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's nice cool. to meet you, but I better go because I've got to go meet somebody. But that's kind of like shallow. Well, it's not shallow. Yeah, it is. No, it's like, not. I'm just meeting you and you're like, bye. I'm, only because I'm late to meet them. Oh. So, I'm not being shallow. So, I'm okay. just being... I don't want to make you late. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet Can you. Can I hug? I so. Okay, take okay. care. Bye. bye. When you met her, did she say, I'm meeting someone before? Or like, she said, I'm about to see someone, or I'm seeing someone, or something like that? Like, as her first, like, response? I think I couldn't hear. I think I heard something just now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So like you kind of knew she was like meeting someone or seeing someone or whatever. So you kind of knew that. Um, <clears throat> all right. Um, it's interesting because you're you're sets you're doing a lot of things kind of okay, and then you're doing a few things kind of. Eh. Um, tonality number one, you are trying for rapport. Can you hear it? Yeah, I can. Okay. Hear it. Um, so that's one thing um, that that should be corrected. Um, as far as like conversation, you said like big shtick, um, which sound anyway. I won't even go into big whatever, but um, it. It does sound like you're trying to run like a particular script. Like there's, there's certain conversational topics you're trying to bring up. And here's the funny thing about it. <clears throat> They're not even good conversational topics. Like guess my age is not a good conversational topic, right? Who cares, right? Um, but yeah, trust yourself. Trust yourself and, and just be you a little bit more as opposed to being like, right? Um, and if you were gonna choose a script, at least choose a good script. Like if you're gonna like run a shtick, at least run a shtick that has some like, you know, some push pull in it. Or like um, a little bit of storytelling or whatever, like running into the same 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 boring questions over and over again is not what you want to do. Okay, does that make sense? Yeah. Like when you when you do the same shit over and over that is is not working or is only marginally working, you're just practicing bad habits. You're just becoming more and more comfortable with that shit, right? <clears throat> so um, this thing. Also, by the way, um, trying to like get them to like guess your age out of nowhere and stuff like that. Um, like if, if they say what's your age and you say guess fine, but if you go I bet I can guess your age and then you're like guess mine, right? You're just like you're trying to get them to comply out of nowhere, like why? Like that's that's your topic, right? Do you understand that? Yeah. Right. So if they're chasing already, getting them to chase more makes sense, but if you're chasing and then you're like chase me instead, right? Doesn't work. Final thing, um, on the on the end, I mean, it's good that you're being persistent. Um, but I feel like this is something that's gonna reflect in the rest of your set as well. As soon as there's a negative, you actually get very like err about it. You're like that's very rude. You can't da 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 da. Right? At that point, you're never gonna win. Not because of, like the situation's not winnable, but at the point where you made it like a confrontation. At the point where you made it like where she has to like be wrong for you to be right, or you started like accusing her and trying to socially like obligate her instead of charm her. That's that's where you're in trouble. Okay? No, never get girls by like socially obligating them you'll get them by like charming them and being fun. So I think change her mood, not her mind. And um, you just understand girls will do what they emotionally want to, not what they're obligated to do. Even if, they're, even if they are obligated to do something, they'll find some kind of emotional reason why not, okay? I was saying it as a joke, but yeah, maybe it was a bit more of an obligation. <laughs> well, you heard her, because yeah. you heard her like response to it. She's like, I'm not, okay, play it. Excuse me, excuse me. Um, I just saw you from over there and you look cool. And I just want to come and see if you're as cool as you seem. That's so nice. Okay. Yeah. But Are you Swedish? No, I am not. I'm German. German. I feel like German people love London. Because, you know, London is so diverse and so many different people. And London is special, huh? Don't you think? You know what I love about you? You've got like a cheeky grin. It's kind of really cool. That's very, well, thank like, you, thank you so much. Like, I'm scared of it, I have to tell <laughs> you. I'm mean, it's okay. <laughs> okay. Right. Yeah, okay, but I just, I just want to have a small chat. And then, like, maybe, like, what are you guys doing this exact moment in time? We're going to a film. 
film? Yes. Because I actually wanted to take you guys for a drink. Because I'm sorry, we just have very precious friendship time at the moment. Okay. Okay, that's cool, that's cool. Okay, have a good day. Okay, bye. This was okay. So again, you kind of have like your agenda, right? You're not actually calibrating in any way to what she's saying, right? <clears throat> so oh, we're busy, and then it's like, oh well, I actually wanted to take you guys for a well, Do you think she cares what you actually wanted to do at this point, right? She had her plan, um, and <clears throat> first of all, you're escalating off negativity. That's number one. Like I wanted to take you for a drink off of like, oh, we gotta go, no, right? Um, the bigger thing though, and this is this is something pervasive, like from the tone tone of your voice through everything is you're constantly like, <clears throat> you're, sent, you're, you're asking. I was gonna say begging, but you're asking. Does that make sense? You're always asking for something. Like, it's, it's trying for a poor tonality. Um, it's, um, I just wanted to have a, a, a quick chat, right? Like, as in like, please, could you give me a little bit of time? There's nothing that's like, um, sort of like, conveying your personality really that much. You can your opinion about London a little bit here, but that, that's about it. Um, but they don't know anything about you, right? Um, and. There's nothing about you that says, like, I'm selective. It's just like, hey, could I please have a moment? Could I please have a word? Could I please have a drink? Could I please have... It's all, it's all like asking, 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 asking. You need to get out of the frame of asking and into the frame of offering. Does that make sense? So instead of asking her for a drink, you're offering a drink with you. Does that make sense? Yeah. Instead of asking her for a moment, you're offering her a moment. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah. That, that yeah. fundamental switch has to happen, okay. right? So what you're doing right now is you're doing like, because um, I, I know you do a lot of sets and everything, right? So what you're doing is <laughs> you're walking up to a lot of girls and you're like, you're, you're, you're begging often, if that makes sense. And if you beg often enough, you'll get a result here and there. But um, it's much better to be offering. Like your, your percentages will go way, way, way up, okay? okay? So what does that mean technically? It means tonality, get it down, get it right. right? You, you can hear it, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, definitely. you can hear the triumph for rapport. Yeah. So that needs to change, especially if you're opening with excuse me. Right? Like I told I was telling like a class yesterday, like the excuse me, I can do it. Hey, excuse me. It's not the same as hey, excuse me? Right? Very, very, very different. <clears throat> right? Not over exaggerating, but you know. Um, so it starts with that. And then it starts with the way that you phrase everything. The way that you phrase everything, the way that you like approach everything you're saying, right? It's not that like the things you're saying are, are that wrong, right? But I mean, like, they're kind of like mundane topics, whatever, it's, but that's not the biggest deal. But it's that everything is, can you please give me an answer? Can you please give me a minute? Can you please go with me for a drink? As opposed to, I can give you, you know, oh, I know this. Oh, um, I have a minute for you. You know what? I would have a drink with you. You see the difference? Right? Yeah. So it's, it's flipping the perspective on everything. It's coming at the moment from a low value frame. Mm hmm. Exactly. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, you had like you have a very grungy look to you, yeah. and it's kind of interesting. So I wanted to say hi. Okay. <clears throat> Same thing. Yeah, yeah. Um, really, really tonality though. So like it's, you can just you can really hear it, right? Hey, you had a really grungy look to you, and you looked very interesting. Okay. And I want to say hi. Okay. It's, just, it's pervasive, man. Okay. Right. Tonality. You gotta. You gotta get that handled. Right, because it's immediately setting you off on the wrong foot. You know that, right? Like from the first moment, yeah, you get tolerated. Yeah, you get like into the conversation, but they're immediately thinking like, oh, okay, not the right category. Oh, okay, here's a guy who's begging. Here's a guy who wants something, right? And that sets the tone for everything else, right? Okay. If you set the right tone, everything else will follow nicely. Set the wrong tone, then like the whole rest of the set, you're fighting uphill. Make sense? Okay. Um. Excuse me. Hi. I'm um, you had like a cool look. I like your jacket. It's kind of so. Okay. I want you to speak to me right now, yeah. and I don't care what you say. Actually, just introduce yourself, but make okay. it breaking report tonality. Okay. Hi. How are you doing? Kind of more. M more. Harder. More breaking. Yeah. Really? Mm hmm. Hi. I'm how are you doing? That was awesome. Yeah. That's how you should be talking. Yes. Okay. okay. Does that make sense? Is Good. It, is it not too strong when you're opening like that? Nope. Okay. Okay. okay so I don't know where the line is really then. Yeah. 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 If anything, go go the other side of the line. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah, but what you did just there was good. Say like a few more sentences. Like, 
<clears throat> whatever. Hi, how are you doing? I just came to see if you're as cool as you seem. Good. You, yeah. Mm -hmm. Keep going. You had a cool look to you. I like the green on your dress. It's pretty cool. Yeah, that's good. That's good. That's like that's not even hardly that's not even harsh breaking by the way. That's yeah. like that's like just south of neutral. Yeah. Just so you know, that's not even like you can go you can go further if you want to. Okay. But you I want at least that. Okay. Okay? At least what you've been just doing. Okay. Got it? Got it. <clears throat> okay. Excuse me. Um so slinky, so sassy. Oh, thank you. I wanted to say hi. Come hi. off the road, come off the road, what the hell? Um nice to meet you. This for you, okay? Um, <clears throat> here are two. One is um, today. I need to walk around like you're a fucking prince. Okay. Okay. You understand? Okay, like you're yeah. fucking royalty. Okay. Okay. Like everybody, just like is in awe of you. Everybody's envious of you. Everybody wants a piece of you. You almost don't have time for them. Like you're the fucking shit. Okay. Okay. The other corollary to this is today, throughout the entire day, I want you to, every time you say something, um, if, it, if you say something low value or even just neutral value, I want you to rephrase it or reframe it as high value. Okay. Right? And then every time you have a thought in your head that's low value, I want you to reframe it as high value. Okay? <clears throat> so every single thing today, you're just like reinforcing high value, high value, high value, high value. Excuse me. Um, I saw you over there and your leather jacket it's kind of not as nice as mine, but kind of matches. Uh, I don't understand, sorry. So I was a little curious. Spanish? Spanish, yeah. Spanish. Hi, I'm nice, nice to meet you. you. I felt like a heart to heart, so ah. I wanted to say hi. <laughs> mine is... Mine is better, what the mine fuck? Is better. Mine is from Zara, what no, the no. fuck? Oh, yours no, yours no. is from Camden Town and... It's <laughs> no. no. Um, you seem cool. And I like that. I like that you guys are friends because it's always good to have a good friend. And you look like very similar. Your face, are, facial expressions are very similar. And your eyes and face a little bit and the rouge is kind of cute. Yeah. <coughs> so here's, so first of all, like, this is all, you know, you're f flirting technically, but it's all positive expression, positive expression. I like this, 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 right? And actually, like, you did, I guess you had one negative expression, my jacket's better than yours or whatever. But it comes off gamey. Like, it just comes off as, as gamey, right? Um, so one, you should have more negatives. But your negatives shouldn't appear like you're trying to be negative. Does that make sense? So if I go to a girl, I'm not like, you're stupid, right? That's, that's not, a, that's not, a, that's just a, that's just a dumb fucking insult, right? That's not a negative expression. That's just dumb, right? Your jacket sucks, right? It should be more like, um... I like you, but I don't know, I'm not so sure about that jacket. Do you see how it's like, it has a positive and a negative to it? I'd be like, you have a very interesting look. You see how it's like, it still has that like insecurity provoking aspect to it, but it's not like, I'm insulting you, right? It's like, so, so two things. Number one, not enough negatives in your set. But two, when you have the negatives, they're very clearly like you tried to be negative, right? As opposed to you're accidentally negative, right? Do you understand the difference? Yeah. yeah okay. Um, so yeah, and the, the, it also does all come back to the high value thing, right? Because it comes off when you do the negative thing, you're like, I want, it, it, it feels like a social adjustment. You're like, I want to adjust the social order by being super negative to you, right? Which is probably what you're doing too, right? You're like, I want to be higher value. So I'm going to, no. You should be so high value, you don't have to insult them. Do you understand that? Yeah. Right? You're so high value, it's just assumed your value, right? And it comes off in everything you do and everything you say, okay? But do a quick little, little role play. You can, you can capture this too if you want to too. Um, <clears throat> but do a quick little role play with me. I want you to pick me up and I want you to be completely high value. Okay? okay. So just like, just pick me up um, as you normally would. If you think to do something high value, do it. If not, I'll cut you off when you do low value things. Okay? okay? Just um, Hey, um, just saw you. Your, your top was kind of interesting. So I just Tonality. Tonality still. Hi, um, I just saw you with that top of yours. Pretty cool. Uh, so, thanks. 
Yeah, I mean, like, um, okay. So, so it's pretty cool. So I want to come and say hi. Okay. Just a little curious, you know, that's it. Just a little curious. Be cocky. Be cocky. Where are you from, like China? That's not, that's insulting. Okay. Well, I mean, unless she looks Chinese, I suppose. Well, like, that's... Yeah, yeah. Like the way you just like insulting. Okay. Um, How would you be cocky? Huh? How would you? What should I say instead? Um, so imply that she's lucky that you're here. Imply that it's a gift that you're here coming over to her. Instead of like justifying, hey, so yeah, I just you know thought I'd come over. As in like, oh, is it okay that I came over? So hey, so I'm here now. So your day can start being more fun. Okay. Right. <laughs> that's like that's over the top, but that's that's the cocky frame. As opposed to, hey, um, yeah, so I saw that and uh, I just was, could I, could I maybe invade on your day for a moment? No. Hey, look at you. What are you doing with yourself? I had to say hi. Okay. This is how you see the difference? Yeah. Okay. One, one of them is like coming across kind of insulting. I mean, playfully insult. Is it more playfully insulting? It's not insulting at all. I mean, I guess what no, are you doing with yourself? What I'm bit? doing, I'm saying. <laughs> um, you're coming across, across permission seeking. Okay. So you're like either permission seeking, permission seeking, or like obviously trying to insult. Okay. Right? What you want to be is permission giving. Does that make sense? Yeah. Right? As in you're the one who holds the permission and you can give it. Yeah, yeah. Right? And then never insulting. Teasing and kidding, but never insulting. Okay. Okay. A little sassy, so you're lucky, but. I didn't have much time, so I just thought I'd say hi. So you're still justifying yourself. Okay. You see that? Like even when you're trying to be caught, you're still justifying. Like, oh, I just, you know, I just thought I'd come over. No big deal. Don't mind me. Do right. you see that? Yes. No. If you say, if the answer is no, say no. Kind it's of, fine. Kind of. Kind of. Okay. Yeah. Don't justify your approach. You're there. Okay. You don't need to explain. Well, she knows. Okay. Right? She knows you came over to talk to her. You don't have to explain that you did. Okay. All right. Do you want to grab a cord? Yeah. 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 He's power cord. No, you're good. You're good. Oh yeah, I'll just I'll just run this. Yeah, that's yeah, fine. Um, okay, do you understand that though? Yeah, right. I understand. <laughs> it's kind of tough though. Such a slinky dress. Trouble. Don't even worry about like insulting on the open. Don't worry about like trying to provoke on the open. Just oh. be high value. Okay. Um hey. Um hey. What are you up to? Hanging out. Bored. Till I came along? Better, right? Um, no, no, I'm, I'm waiting for friends, but yeah. Oh. And now you're going to dump them for me? That's really kind of you. I mean, like... Okay, so that's a little cocky, but okay. Like, that's, that's, that's fine for now. Yeah. That's a little, like, try-hard cocky, but it's fine. It's, I'd, rather, I'd rather you be try-hard cocky than not cocky at all. Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. All right. Um, what you're doing there, though, by the way, is, um, and this is another symptom you have, is you're asking for a commitment from her, right? So there's a difference between, like, being cocky is fine, but you're, you're being cocky and asking for compliance, right? Are you going to ditch them from me? You're, it's a yes or no answer that she almost can't say yes to without being slutty. Yeah. So you're, you're asking for a no. Do you understand that? All right. So I like the cockiness of it. That's what I like. I like the cockiness of it, but I don't like to ask for compliance of it. Just avoid the nose kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. I like the tone, though. I like the cocky tone. That's good. But the asking for compliance, right? Right. So instead of like, are you going to ditch them from me? That's like, obviously not. So why are you asking? Are they right? going to ditch you from me? <laughs> that, that's also like, it's too, it's too, it's like, right? Okay. Um, like, oh, that's okay. Well, I'm here now and I'm better, but I'm sure like, I'm sure they're wonderful as well. Does that make sense? Yeah. But it's not, it's the cockiness is fine. It's that like asking for commitment. See the difference? Right. If you, if you're, <clears throat> if you ask for compliance when someone's not ready, you're immediately, it just kills your social capital. Right. Don't do that. Stop asking for compliance. Right. right cool. um, again, don't, don't try and force the girl into anything. Try and charm her into it. Okay. Do you see the difference? Yeah. Okay. Um, but you're doing better with the cocky. Keep okay. it coming a little bit. <clears throat> Nice, nice shoes. Thank you. Appreciate it. I picked them myself. You've got good taste. I'm not going to lie. Thank you. You want to get to the point? Um, 
There's no point. I'm just here. Really? Live. Oh, well, in that case, you can go. Underworld. There's a point. Okay. There is a point, right? Are you there with a point or not? Yeah. What's your point? I want to meet her. Good. Okay. So get to the point. Okay. So the point is, um, I had a little time and you looked kind of interesting. Tonality. It, Tonality. And you look kind of interesting. Good. So I'm just like saying hi. Cool. That's yeah. better. That's better. Yeah, okay. Okay? Do you understand? Do you understand all the little things that we're correcting? Okay? Now it's going to be like you're obviously not going to go out and be perfect, right? But get that tonality, man. Like all the time, <clears throat> right? You just, I want you to take on the, the that, that's your thing today. Not during, not during classroom training, but during all the rest of the day. Okay. Take the attitude that you're better than everyone else. Okay? Okay. Okay, not during classroom training. But the entire rest of the day, you're better than everyone else. Okay? okay? You're the shit. You're amazing. Everyone wants a piece of you. You're the highest value person ever. I want you to take that fucking attitude. Okay? Like, literally get used to that idea of I am the fucking prince. I am the fucking prince. Okay? We got it? Yeah. All right. Cool. I just want that fucking exuded in like everything today. Okay. Cool. And fucking tonality. Get a tape recorder. Okay. Like, the, get a tape recorder. If you don't have one, or you just use it, you can use your computer. <clears throat> you can also just do it on your computer. Okay, either way, whatever, yeah. right? But I want you to actually like speak it, like speak assertive, like game the wall into your dictaphone, okay. okay? And then play it back and check your tonality, and do it until your tonality actually is right, So it actually like, you know what I mean? Because you can hear the difference when you when you hear it on screen, you can hear it, right? But you don't hear it when you're saying it. No, I don't hear it at all. I, I don't even <clears throat> realize I'm doing it. So, so get that feedback loop, all right? Get used to it. Okay. okay? Get your fucking tonality right. Okay. Good. And you're the prince. <laughs>